Origin 50. Easily the most difficult and annoying skill to max out in Hypixel Skyblock. And if you say, No, it's fishing. No, 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 no. Fuck you. With most skills like fishing, you can just place a bunch of minions down and let them do the work for you. They'll work for free and forever. All you have to do is come back now and then to take the XP and loot they collected over time. No need to thank them. Nothing. But not foraging. Foraging minions are fucking useless. Like, actually useless. They're slow, they don't give much XP at all, and they're really, really messy. For foraging, you only have two options. One, you put on a fast set of armor, pick up your best axe, and run through the forest. You'll have to be fully focused on what you're doing and deal with the other people trying to do the same thing for around 600,000 XP an hour on average. Maybe more if you're really, really sweaty. And two, you set up some contraption on your island, which I won't show you how to make because I'm really, really lazy. And you can essentially just hold left click and watch every single Marvel movie available to you. But that's like under half of what you can make with the first option. And that's why after two years of playing the game, forging remains my lowest skill stuck at 26 possibly forever i swore a year and a half ago that i would not hit a single tree myself again because of how frustrating it was but what if i told you there's a third option what if i told you there was a way to get that 600k xp from option one but instead of 600,000 every hour it's every three and a half minutes i'm talking 10 million 428,571 xp per hour now, let me go back a few hours before Dio and I figured that out. I logged in and did my usual sha in guild chat to say hello. Then another guild member said, Forging 50 from Jerry Boxes when? Little did he know that led to Dio and I finding out how to get Forging 50 in about 5 hours from zero. With the first inventory of green Jerry Boxes I bought, I really did not get much skill XP. The main issue is that green boxes only gave 2,500 XP, but not every box would give XP. On top of that, it wasn't always forging experience. The Chances would be split between mining, farming, and forging. But the items and coins I got from the green boxes, I only managed to get around 110 million coins back from the 170 mil it cost me to get them. And I gained a whole level, making me level 27 forging. It wasn't bad, but I thought that was the best way to get my skill up. So I kept buying green boxes and opening them until the price for full inventory went from 170 million to 260. By the time I ruined the price of green boxes, I had level up to 28 and made back about 80% of what I spent on them which wasn't bad but i, I kind of needed to move on at that point so i started buying blue boxes which were now cheaper than the green ones the blue ones gave 5,000 skill xp instead of 2.5k i opened a little over 1.5 billion worth of blue boxes before the price was also ruined making my way to forging 31 i only made 350 million of that money back because the items you get from boxes don't change with rarity you literally get the same items from green boxes than from legendary boxes with the price of the blue boxes ruined i only had two options left the purple boxes and the legendary boxes the purple ones gave 20,000 xp each four times higher than the blue ones but the price was way way higher we're talking like 600 million per inventory up to about 1.2 billion per inventory at inflated prices second option was already out of question legendary boxes gave 100,000 xp but you're not able to stack them so opening them and buying more would take so much time and most of the boxes you'd open would only give the coins reward so i decided to buy the purple ones i bought a full inventory just to try it out and it cost me like 900 million coins i literally went from forging 31 to 35 in less than 40 minutes i got in a call with dio and piggy Cole a bit after to show them when you're done just please void the chair fuck you no, no fucking way you no way do it it'll be funny it'll Even be funny don't push it this was 500 mil earlier Bro, oh uh, my you, you've got to Please tell me you have shadow play and you just do that. Look at this. Look at this no. was a 170 this morning. Bro, how much is that now? 300? Yeah. This is 900. And then if you do purple, it's 100. Uh, it's a fucking 1064. Oh my god. Please well, if it was 900, bud. do it. It'll be funny. You have so many coins. What are you going to use them on? Wouldn't it be so funny if I just. No! <laughs> <laughs> Bro, I opened a full inventory of purple boxes with them and leveled up to forging 42 insanely fast. We're done. <laughs> oh my god! I could only buy all of these. <laughs> yes. Oh no! Should I buy them just for the fuck of it? No.
Eventually, I bought every single one of them on the market and I ran out of boxes to open. I had no boxes left. I was forging 44 and I already invested too much into this to give up now. So what did I do? I... Uh, I went to bed and that was probably the best decision I could have taken because after laying down for less than five minutes, I received a discord message from Theodore, a former moderator in my guild. Tio, if you're watching this, I fucking love you, dude. Tio said that he saw me buying them and that he had 2,800 purple boxes to sell. I got back on PC, talked him into giving me a lower price <laughs> and then got online for the trade. He sold me a total of 2,880 purple boxes for 880 million coins. The man is a fucking legend. How the fuck did you get? I, I don't. One, you're so dumb for buying those. <laughs> Why? <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my God. Aren't they beautiful? <laughs> Bro, you can make like a literal like movie out of doing this, I swear. After opening all 2,800 boxes, I reached forging level 46. Dio made some calculations and established that I only needed 4,432 more boxes to reach forging 50. So I just bought them straight off the bazaar the next day, since more people were now selling them. It cost me pretty much exactly 2 billion coins. Hello, young men. Hello, I have a headache. I want to see numbers go up. I've never heard that from anyone. I have a headache. I want to see numbers go up. All right, I have all these and all these. Oh my god. And these should be the final boxes. Is that all you need to get to it? Yeah, this should be about what I need. And so, Dio and I opened all 4,432 boxes needed to get Forging 50. I quickly reached Forging 47, but 48 and 49 took way longer than we expected, and we ran out of boxes again, one level away from 50. Fortunately, I take a lot of contraband on stream. Don't shut TV slash Aiken soft. So I spent a lot later on and bought the rest, which was about 1,250 boxes. All right, Dio, that's the last stretch. How many boxes is it? Uh, around 1,200, I think. I'll do 1,250. All right, it is time. It is time for Forging 50. And finally, after struggling for over a day, we found ourselves opening the last batch we needed to reach max forging level. What's funny about this is you'd be getting insane amounts of XP for farming and mining too, but I was already done with those two skills. So for those two skills, I just ended up with a really insane amount of XP extra. And there you hey. go, forging 50. Nice. With a whole stack to go. With a whole stack that you saved. There's forging no 50. Way. So this is how I got Forging 50. I spent 7.5 billion coins. I bought around 19,500 dairy boxes, which were purple in majority. And it took three hours to open them all in total. It would have cost me less than 3 billion coins if I bought them at the proper price when Jerry is mayor, but... I, I really wanted to make this video as fast as possible. This is officially the fastest way to obtain max forging, farming, and mining skills. If you're curious on how many boxes that would take, 21,283 purple boxes for 3.4 billion coins at an average price, and 5-6 to six hours of your life opening the boxes. I think it's also worth mentioning that my friend Antonio made a mod for me so that my cursor would be placed directly on the center of my inventory in opening boxes to make them faster to open, requiring only 2 clicks and closing the inventory straight away. And that's going to be it for today. I hope you liked the video uh subscribe if you enjoyed it and i will be making more of these in the future bye bye